guys, welcome to another video. Hope you're all keeping well. Uh, now, for this video, I'd like to review uh, a Blu-ray that I watched there uh, just the other night um, from 1986. It's a Wes Craven production uh, and a um, very, very enjoyable movie. And that is a movie called Deadly Friend. Yeah. If you're not, if you're not familiar with this movie, guys, as per usual, I'll just read you the blurb at the back and then you give me give you me thoughts on the storyline as a whole. Okay. Um, a Breakfast Club version of The Bride of Frankenstein. I certainly wouldn't disagree with that. From director Wes Craven, it comes a terrifying tale of technology gone haywire. Lonely teenage genius Paul, um, a specialist in brain research, has two best friends, his remarkable robot and the beautiful girl next door, played by Christy Swanson from Buffy the Vamp Vampire Slayer. Now, when tragedy, tragedy strikes both of his friends, he desperately tries to save them by pushing technology beyond its known limits into a terrifying new realm. Like a modern-day Dr. Frankenstein, Paul discovered too late that he has created a rampaging monster. Deadly Friend is a witty ghoul story, deliberately teeters on the edge of spoof. So there you go, guys. That's a synopsis for the 1986 Wes Craven production of Deadly Friend. Yeah. Okay, then, guys. On to my thoughts on their Deadly Friend as a whole. Thoroughly enjoyed it. It's staying in my collection. And, uh, yeah, really, uh, you know, this is the second time I've watched this movie. First time on Blu-ray. Uh, and the first time I ever watched it was on VHS back in the late 80s, you know, when I first got my first uh, VHS video recorder. Great performances all around, particularly by the, the main girl, Christy Swanson, uh, from, uh, you know, uh, played uh, Buffy and, uh, Buffy the Vampire Slayer in the movie. But, uh, yeah, it's a kind of a modern-day Frankenstein, you know, uh, because you've got this guy, like, the main protagonist and that, you know, and uh, something dreadful happens, like, you know, to his girl, and like, he falls in love with this girl, and she's got a real, oh, she's got a real son of a bitch of a father, you know, and uh, I'll try not to give too much away, guys, but uh, one particular uh, particular um, day, the father picks on the girl, and he knocks her down the stairs, and she dies, and that, you know, so, um, yeah, so, a very, very tragic, a uh, tragic scene, that, you know, uh, but then, like, um, you know, uh, the, the, uh, Paul, like, the lad, like, he has, he has this sort of, like, uh, idea with him being good with robots and that, and technology, of uh, trying to bring the girl back to life and that, so he's sort of, like, kidnap he sort of, like, uh, whips the body, from the morgue and that, you know, and he um, he sort of like messes around on that with a bay and that, and he brings her back to life. But as is always the case with these movies where they try to resurrect the dead, they're not quite the same. So she's she's come back all right, but she's come back in this sort of like a uh, emotionless, cold, robot, robotic figure, uh, walks very stiff and that, and she's got no bones about killing somebody. And of course, her first talk is as a wicked father. Yeah, say no more about that. Yeah, but it, oh yeah. It's a very, very enjoyable movie, guys. I love Deadly Friend from start to finish. And if you haven't seen it, I highly recommend it. A great performance by this girl, you know, Christy Swanson and that, you know, playing a sort of like female uh, Frankenstein monster. You know, I really love the premise, you know, uh, bringing... And I love Frankenstein, like, you know, my fra you know, me, I love um, my favourite movies, the Frankenstein movies. I want to see anything even remotely, re remotely related to a Frankenstein um, narrative and there yeah but oh yeah full marks to Wes Craven uh, for this uh, producing this fantastic uh, you know sci-fi horror movie Deadly Friend and that you know and uh, the characters as well are support and cast are good and you've got this sort of like um, grumpy old woman she's got she's got a <laughs> she's got a face like a man you think it was a man and drag it's a woman like but she's got a bloody big man's face and that you know and she's a nasty piece of work and that you know she doesn't like kids going uh, encroaching on property and that you know but of course she falls into the path of um this girls are sort of like that the next targets and that but i won't go on too much about that you'll have to see the movie for yourself you know it's a sort of like uh, you know you'll see what i mean yeah but uh, no slip cover with this guys unfortunately but um you've got the nice uh disc there and you've got the reversible artwork as well but i prefer this guys i prefer this uh, artwork yeah but if you haven't seen Deadly Friend, I highly recommend it. But it's only if you like these sort of like technology horror movies now with a Frankenstein theme. I think you'll get a lot of pleasure out of Deadly Friend. And it, yeah, this has taken pride of place on my shelf, on my shelf with all my other classic horror movies. Now, great performances, lovely colour. They did a great job at the restoration. And uh, yeah, I highly recommend Deadly Friend to any horror fan. Okay, then, guys, on to a rating now. Well, you must probably got a, got a hunch what I'm going to say. A full 10 hours of 10 for Deadly Friend because I enjoyed every single minute of it and I'm going to watch it again in a couple of weeks' time. Yeah, it's a sort of movie that you can go back to again and again and again. And as I say, great performances by Christy Swanson. As a, You know, it's got like a kind of a Greek tragedy aspect to it as well. You know, the, the girl getting killed by her father, albeit accidentally and that, you know, getting knocked down the stairs and banging her head and that. 
and then like a boyfriend bringing her back you know it doesn't say um, that's any cost to bring her back and we're in be being gifted and that you know with, with the robotics and that there's also a suggestion of the short circuit a uh, robot as well because he, he builds us like robots and that you know paul and if you've got that aspect as well but yeah on the whole yeah i really enjoyed deadly friend and i can't recommend it enough okay then guys that's it that's it i'll just bring the video to a close now if you like it you know usual please feel free to share subscribe comment and all going well i shall be back again very very soon with another video take care guys have a nice weekend bye for now